Okay, guys, welcome to part six of uh, Quadron plays Laura Croft, or Tomb Raider. No, we are playing Laura Croft, that's the character, but yes. So, in case you haven't checked up on any of the other ones, basically she's stranded on an island. We found the captain, and now we're trying to relay a signal to the outside world. We've got the radio, we've uh, got a pistol now, and we've got a pickaxe, and apparently we're supposed to climb... Up to the peak, I guess. So they can climb this. They can climb, climb, craggy walls. Okay. What the? Okay. Oh, okay. I gotta move up. She automatically does it. Wow, she's she is really good at this. Guess we need to keep going up here. And there we go. Get some salvage for weapon upgrades. Excellent. Get all of those that we can. And uh, up we go. I think I'm just gonna jump. No point in climbing right now. Oh, wait. Oh, nice. I can actually have her jump. <laughs> jump and then latch onto the wall. Move sideways and jump. Oh god! Okay, move left. Let's jump. Oh my gosh. And I'm having to press... You know, like, it doesn't automatically latch. I actually have to manually press it to latch, so... It's kind of scary. I'm guessing we need to keep going this way. Whee! This is where I fought like a badass wolf. Or, yeah, it was insane. It was like last episode. Uh, so if you, if you missed that, be sure to go check that out. That was insane. We really well done animation of fight scenes in this. So, just keep going up. And here we go. Going to the top. Top of the mountain. Oh, gosh. Can you imagine doing this kind of thing in real life? It's just insane. Okay. Wait, what? I have to move left and press... Wait, I don't have to. Oh, I don't get it. Okay. Hey, you find anything? No, nothing. Oh God. What? Nothing. There's no one up here. They never make it up this far. Exactly. Hey, I need help. Right in the face. Excellent. Okay, so get some more arrows. Wait, what? Where are you going? <laughs> oh my God. Freaking scared the hell of me. Okay. Hello, chicken. You get XP. And you don't lose any arrows, so why not, right? As long as you hit them. And... Something's up here, I see. Go ahead and get this. This got some XP. Oh, oh crap. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Okay, so it looks like there's a bunch of different ways I can get up there. Let's try this first. Oh god, missed it. Get on up, yeah. Oh god. It like started sweeping me out to sea or whatever. Not at the sea, but like, you know, down the waterfall. Okay, and... Oh, what is this? Oh, I can light it. Uh, I don't have... A torch, I don't think. What is this? A we'll kind of mortar and pestle. Probably oh, used for preparing medicinal herbs. Okay. Sounds like something my mom would get. She's like all into the herb stuff. Alright, um, and we're going this way. <laughs> what was that animation? <laughs> um. Oh, I can light this. Does this ever do anything? Oh, it gives me salvage. 
see what you did there. Okay, I'm gonna go light this thing over here too, see what this is. Illumination, challenge unlocked, complete for XP. That's so good. Oh, I have to light 10 statues, I guess, in the game. She is really good at catching herself. Even with the freaking torch. Okay. And up we go. I wonder if she's gonna have a torch when I get top. I doubt it. Oh no, yeah, the torch is out now. Can I climb this? We're gonna find out! Easy peasy. Oh my god! <laughs> Nice. She Love, is fantastic. Like, seriously, she's amazing. Ryan, did you find Sam? We're still on her trail. I'm going to try and send an SOS from an old radio tower up here. Any tips? Hey, Laura. You're going to need to find the communications console. It'll Wait, look like a this bunch guy's of still alive? Bridge. Okay. I'll let you know when I find it. This guy totally betrayed her. I'm, I'm telling you already. Got it. Hey, hey, wake up, wake up, the Come on, grab her. Wake up, hide. You don't need to do this. Oh, it's the face. Come on, show your face again. Right to the face. Excellent. Get my arrows back. And a little bit of salvage and XP. Of course, I want all the salvage so I'm going to do with this guy's thing. So I get my career and my weapons faster. That could be plus 25. So killing, I guess killing guys should do a lot more salvage than not killing them or whatever. Oh, and this thing gives me salvage too. So let me go ahead and ignite my torch again. And ignite this thing. And there we go. Excellent. Oh, well, that's 30 salvage. That's really good. All right. I have a bad feeling about this. Me too, actually. Why is there already a freaking radio tower up here? Sleep up here. Oh, we're gonna watch another flashback video. I'm telling you, Reyes, it's mechanical, not an electrical problem. Now, Alex. <coughs> uh, this looks like it might be a, an electrical problem. You think? <coughs> oh, hello. Hey. Is this little fox, huh? Oh, yeah. He's cute, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's Alicia. Alicia. It's my right daughter. There. Oh. Fourteen years old. <laughs> I'm smarter than you'll ever be. <laughs> she must must get that from her father. Oh my God. Don't give him the attention. And oh my yeah. I'll take a look at this. Probably electrical. <laughs> That's bad. That's so bad. From her father. So I was on the walk, right? Awesome. Doing a spot of midnight fishing. Hey, Grim, time to button down the hatches. I be right with you. So I was on the walk, right? And this thing comes looming at me, looming out of the water it was. So I give her a old Glasgow kiss, you know. <laughs> Get shot of trouble nine times out of ten, that does. Took me a week to sleep that night off, and I've not touched a drop since. See you at dinner, Sam. I, I, I just totally missed, like, the beginning of that. <laughs> Ooh, got a thing going on over here. Hello, hello. All right, can we take B roll, please? Thank you. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take three, and action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like this. Yeah, you got it. Good Lord, cut, cut, cut! Cut. <laughs> 
wuss. She's coming back. <laughs> She's seriously such a wuss. No, it's ridiculous. Like, what the Discover. hell? The world renowned that guy's ridiculous. The world renowned doctor. This damned reality TV business. I'm, I'm meant to be bringing culture to the people, Sam, not dinner. Uh, no offense, Jonah. <laughs> the audience demands content, Dr. Whitman. You know that. Demands so until content. we find the Lost Kingdom, we need footage like this. Come on, let's just take it from the top, okay? We're gonna make you look like Gordon Ramsay in editing. <laughs> Dr. James Whitman, All Miller right. 15, take four, action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like that. I've studied them <laughs> so much, I can see charts on the back of my eyelids. But if I'm not right about Yamatai being in the Dragon's Triangle... I remember when you found that one, your father's digs. You ran up and showed it to me dressed in your penguin pajamas. <laughs> I was five <laughs> years old, it was my first find. Yeah. You've got great instincts, girl. You just have to trust them. Mm, that's what my father used to say. Now, there was a man that ran on instinct. For better or worse. He would have been so proud of you, Lara. Oh. We're getting closer to the storm. Oh. Well, whatever's coming, we'll get through it, eh? <laughs> oh, man, that's foreshadowing. They're gonna make it out. I believe it. I believe in Laura and Rolf, the father figure. Okay, Laura. Pull yourself together. Okay, Put guys. That it wraps up part six. So this is, uh, yeah, I'm streaming right now on Twitch.tv forward slash Quadron TV. So if you want to catch the live view of Tomb Raider, it means I play through. Awesome. And uh, if not, that's all good too. Uh, you can check out the the VODs on uh, YouTube.com forward slash Quadron TV. And anyway, so that ends part six. We're going to be moving on to part seven right now. <laughs>